All right, now scanning the documents using the phone is something which we regularly do. At least a lot of us prefer doing on the phone instead of using a document scanning machine or the printer. Now scanning the documents using phone's cameras is implemented in different ways on different devices. However, on the iPhones, the document scanning feature using the camera is very, very impressive. And I'm sure you're gonna love it and you wish to have this feature on Samsung Galaxy phones as well. So let's go ahead and compare this and see which one is better and uh, should Samsung consider implementing this or not do drop a comment and let me know now on samsung galaxy phones to scan a document we open the camera and we point the camera on the document the ai will recognize that it's a document it will show us this icon at the bottom right we can tap on this the ai will adjust the borders for the documents to scan it and then if you want to do some post adjustments you can do this and tap on save now this will be saved in jpg format inside your gallery that's one way of doing it the other way is you can open the Samsung Notes application, tap on new note, and then tap on this attachment icon on the top right. Here we have got an option scan. Again, the same process, we point the camera at a document. As soon as it recognizes the borders, you can just tap on the shutter button to save it on the notes. Now on the notes, we will be able to save this particular scan document in PDF format as well. Now the problem here is, if you have multiple documents to scan, then you will have to keep doing this process for each document. You open the camera, scan it, save it. You open the notes, on the notes, you tap on attachment, select scan, and then again scan a document. That's how we do it on Samsung Galaxy phones. Now let's see how it works on the iPhones. On iPhones, we can't really scan the documents using the camera camera application directly. So to scan the documents, we need to open iPhone's files application. Tap on the three dot button on the top right corner. Here we will see an option scan documents. I'll tap on this. The camera opens up. Now as and when I point the camera at a document, it automatically scans it and captures the image and converts it into a PDF file in a Jiffy. We don't really have to press the shutter button. It automatically detects the document and scans it and saves it. And if you have multiple pages to scan, all you need to do is go to the next page. Again, it scans it automatically and saves it in PDF format inside files application. That is just brilliant, isn't it? It's so easy to scan the documents on iPhones using this impressive feature. Once it's done, just tap on save. The document will be right here inside the files application. This is in PDF format. You just open it. As you can see, all the documents you have scanned are saved in a single file and we will be able to share it right from here. This is pretty good if you are into scanning the documents using your phone more often. You would love to use it on the iPhones, whereas on the Samsung Galaxy phones, I wouldn't say it's bad, but the implementation could be better. Maybe they can look into the Apple's implementation on this feature and enable something similar on the Galaxy phones. Let me know what do you think. Drop a comment. If you haven't subscribed to the channel already, go ahead, subscribe to the channel and hit the like button if you find this video useful. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.